Good morning. We're so glad you're here. We daily vlog, so if you like this video, we hope it'll come back tomorrow. So the kids actually transferred into the car and stayed asleep. Mm -hmm. It's and 3 o'clock. It's rainy, and it's a little bit louder up there than it is in here. So we're going to stay in here. We as in Sarah and the boys. Yeah, Peter I'm not going to stay in here. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna go through security and grab a coffee and maybe a bite to eat. Um, but the corrals will open up. Hopefully the kids will still be asleep by the time the corrals open. So I think this is the last time we're gonna see each other oh until the race starts. Run Disney events look a little different with the little ones, yeah. but... <laughs> it's, a, it's great all the same. Yeah. If you want So, Florida craziness weather is, it's drizzling right now, but it was like full on pouring when we left our home. And I was like, oh no. And I text Steve and I was like, is it raining? Because he stayed on property this uh, last night because he's running today. Um, and he sent me a screenshot of like his like fancy weather app. And he was like, no, it's like a little, little blurb. And it just happened to be over my home when we were getting ready to leave. So I got drenched on when we were getting into the car, and now it's just like this little spittle right now. I mean, it's kind of like a heavy spittle, but um, makes me a little concerned about the road conditions being a little wet and slippery and oftentimes, well, I mean, like as long as it stops raining the next like 15, 30 minutes, we're still two hours away from start time. That gives it enough time to hopefully like, they can situate themselves for character spots and meet and greets. And this is, technically the latest I got to the front this weekend because security is already open but honestly they must have opened up security like 90 seconds ago and I'd rather just walk right through than have to wait in the line oh yeah <laughs> oh I'm so pretty that's the way to get welcomed into the Epcot yes so good <laughs> All right, here we go. Finish line. We'll see you in a couple hours. Oh, so steep already. Look at this line over here. And that, of course, is for the wonderful and not always present pairing of Buzz and Woody. So we got Mater out. I think this is George Sanderson again. And then, boom. Buzz and Woody. And I think Wally will be coming out here eventually. Okay, we got some coffee and muffin action here. Seems like a calmer. I mean, I think it seems calm because everybody is in line for Buzz and Woody. But it seems calm so far. I also could see the resort buses being slightly delayed because of the rain that came through, but it's already done. Decent crowd over there by the Star Crawl. They're not gonna open those up until like 3.45, close to four. So I'm gonna enjoy some brekkie. Look who I found. They, oh! they let people from Brooklyn in. in, in they the, let total animals in this place. <laughs> uh, we're getting ready. We're doing our little bathroom break before we hit to the corrals. Steve's gonna run a 6.35 pace. 6.35 pace. half mile pace. <laughs> Ooh. 30 minutes until showtime. And hey, corrals looking pretty packed already. Time to bob and weave my way a little bit. It is humid. 2.70 or 68 and it's 70 degrees sweat's gonna be going nowhere here so everyone's reducing time even the galloway pacers removed their their 730 group and they're only starting at eight minute miles all righty the boys and i have left the car it's 4 30. we're gonna make our way to the starting line kind of see how they do i wasn't sure if anyone was gonna wake up it's getting obviously louder there's a helicopter above us starting line is over there so I'm assuming as it gets louder and louder the chances of waking up are increasing but as for right now we're all good I had plenty of time to just relax get us all situated Teddy's still in his sleep sack we are ready to cheer on daddy there she is look how glorious Literally 
he strolled up. Perfect timing to see Daddy. High five. High five. Before I forget and it gets too loud, I mean it's gonna be <laughs> loud wherever I am today. Um, it is not lost on me how much like this experience is so different than it used to be for me especially um, but the whole reason we started doing Run Disney is for these these children here my goodness so like every time we're here it is just like takes your breath away but that's why Peter started running to live long for our kids and um, became so passionate about it and it's just been such a team journey even like fundraising with ACS and whatnot this weekend is so special all run Disney events are so special and even though I don't necessarily come out to every single event the reason I can't is tenfold worth it so that's my that's my piece maybe I won't get emotional again today but it's probably not likely Right, sons. Woo! Hey, Pat. Yeah. It's pretty nice out today, right? Oh, it's a nice breeze out. It's nice and cool. Like mid 60s is amazing. I wish that's, that was true. It's called a sarcastic Midwest sense of terrible humor. <laughs> it's disgusting out. It's so hot, humid. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Look at these outfits. I wasn't gonna do it, but. Patrick said he'd wait, so let's do it. Two, one, go! Oh, and the nosy rosy. So we're in a little baby care tent. Teddy's finishing up a bottle. Yeah. Yeah. James, he's just snacking. There is a changing table and all sorts of other things that you could need in here. Now that we're all fresh, we got a little smoothie from Goldie. And now we're gonna go see some characters. This is the funniest little mile mark I've ever seen. Oh my god, Ian and Barley. Jamesy, this one's for you. Booyah. Oh, oh Past mile nine, one more mile. I just lost Patrick. I was like, you know what, Pat, this is my speed. I'm, I'm, I'm shifting down a couple a couple notches. If you got the gas, just go. And we like slowly distanced ourselves. And I stopped for a shot of that nine mile and he was gone. So, But I have to thank him greatly because he kept me far faster this whole race than I thought I would be able to get done considering I started running for this two weeks ago. Um, but now I'm gonna enjoy a little future world and Sarah and my babies are waiting for me in less than a mile. Less than a mile, that's all. Let's go finish this out. A little sunrise, a little showcase lagoon. How about that, friends? Gorgeous.
there's a really cool challenge metal. Boom, boom. And then the 10 miler. Woo. Here he is. The big man. How you feel? Pretty good. So sweaty. I just left you, man. I, I just know. left you. <laughs> Congrats. Thank you, thank you. Hey, you, thank you. You kept me going those nine miles, man. It was, it was trouble, but yeah, we got there. We did, we did. <laughs> Are you getting him? Did <laughs> he tickle in his feet? Good job. Hi, babies. Hi, Jamesy. Look, they got you guys medals. Hey, go. Wow. Good job, Daddy. Nice, How was it? Really good. Yeah? Really good, yeah. It is significantly nicer now than it was when you started. It was awful for most of the rest. Steve! thousand years later we good afternoon we're so happy you're here it feels like a different day we are alive and well we have emerged <laughs> from we all kind of took naps yeah guys so like we the were home took, Daddy took two naps i don't even know the last thing we vlogged but like we were home before like 8 30 a.m yeah but everybody was like Phew. so yeah james took one nap James took a long nap. James took a long nap. Teddy's taking two naps. Yeah. We both took little snoozes while they were napping. Yeah. And then we just kind of like chilling. Yeah. We just like relaxing. Recharged. We did decide to come out to Animal Kingdom. We were able to switch our park pass. Um, it is like the best for our needs tonight. And that yeah. means like low wait times, chill, like getting here. We want to give like kids. James a lot of fun stuff to do because yeah. they've been cooked up in the stroller a lot this weekend with just the running arounds and stuff. Yeah. So we're going to try to do a bunch of stuff. This is a cool oh, Nat Geo. Oh. Cool. So we're here. It's uh, what is it, 5.30? Mm -hmm. it's almost 6 maybe? Our first stop. We're grabbing dinner. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. What's that place called? Flame Tree Barbecue. <laughs> and then we're gonna do a safari before, before it closes. closes. Yeah. Bippity boppity bit. Fabulous. Nice job, Your Majesty. Thank you. You want to have a wild Majesty? How have we never seen this? This is called a rhinoceros iguana, a ground-dwelling reptile. Gets its name from horn-like scales on its face. I've been to Animal Kingdom. A couple of two, three times. Probably close to a hundred times. Yeah. And I've never seen this like beautiful black neck swan. An oasis. Yeah. Is a swan? What? I've seen swans in downtown Orlando. I know this is just like classic merchandise, but like this is just so stinking cute. The socks, the hat, like sometimes basic is just the best. One of my favorite things about Flame Tree Barbecue is where you sit and eat on the water. Seating over here is usually packed and it is not today. So we're actually sitting by this water, like this fountain-ish area. Um, we were just talking that, obviously there was the race weekend, so there was people here, but it has seemed just like more chill in the parks. And so we're thinking that it's that like really cush time of year between spring break and summer vacation where the parks like lull for events. And so we're gonna be taking advantage of that for sure. Are you roaring? Or he says woof woof woof. Uh, or he says oh 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 he's a hound dog. Oh oh oh. That's why I got their smokehouse chicken salad. I've gotten this before. It's got really yummy dressing and little dried craisins and croutons. We also got some fries and onion rings.
elephant. There's actually two types of elephants in the world. There's the Asian elephant. Distinguish the two because the African elephant is Asian. Yeah. cute Lion King merchandise. We said this shop in um, Harambe Village is always a winner. And this shirt is totally Peter and I. Two proud members of the Queen Plate Club. Oh, those are nice. Wow, look at the sun peeking through. Gorgeous, gorgeous sunset. All right, so there's not too much time left before the park closes, but it says that Navi River Journey is only 25 minutes. So we're gonna try to hop on that and, um, I almost said Soren, not Soren. Flight of Passage is only 35, so if that continues to go down, we might go on Navi River Journey and then see if we can like snag a child swap right as the park's closing. I don't know, I don't know. You don't know what? And this, my friends, is not a 25 minute wait. We're going right to the cave. Oh, this out. I'm just loving the Animal Kingdom vibes at this hour with this, the lighting. And the breeze. Well, that was a walk on. Yeah. That was unexpected. However, we were hoping to come out and go on Flight of Passage and do a little child swap, but it went up to almost an hour. Yeah, from so, 35. So we have like, what, 20 minutes left to park? Yeah. Hours, so we're gonna go to Dino Land. Do a little Triceratops spin. Uh, Go, go, go! Go, go, go! One last time. I love them. I've already got some damage from wearing them, but that's what happens. I also have a plan that I think Sarah and I have agreed upon. We should have to execute it, and it's to get like a tension, like industrial wire across our garage to hang all the metals. Yeah, it's gonna be nice. So we're like going to do a live stream about this, mm. but we're going to be making some changes to the vlog. And this is like the last like true, like single daily vlog we'll have for a bit. Um, we're going to start still daily, daily vlogging, but having it 
like in one big vlog once a week. And we're just gonna try it out. We're seeing how it goes. So even though we're saying it here, we're gonna talk about a live stream on Wednesday. So if you happen to be watching this video, I'll link that here because with the timing, this will go up around the same time, so. We'll see it, we're figuring out like creatively what that means and mm -hmm. how uh, we're gonna film how that means and when we're gonna edit how that means. Yeah. So it's definitely a work in progress. We're gonna give it a try. We've been talking about it for a couple days now mm -hmm. and we're gonna just wing it and yeah, see. Yeah, still a daily vlog, but just a different like daily film, execution. Just a, yeah, different of, formatting. Uh, yeah, different format of how you all receive it. And then hopefully there will be time for live streams and like more interaction this is like a thing i haven't even mentioned to you is a re like bringing back the recap videos mm -hmm. because that's like just there i'll have a little bit more time and more creative outlet so it's, it's good, good to be, be home. home we know what our goals are we know what we hope to accomplish and believe me it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.